New abortion bills in multiple states, including Alabama, are causing opponents to rally against the bills, like this gathering in Alabama. The governor of Alabama signed a law last week that makes performing an abortion a felony, with providers facing the possibility of 99 years in prison. Hundreds of rallies are scheduled across the country this week. News Center Samantha York shows us why some people in Maine say they need to join this fight. No justice! No peace! It's a message activists want heard loud and clear. After lawmakers in Alabama and other states prepare to make drastic changes to their abortion laws. Is the baby in a womb a person? And we believe technology and science shows that it is. That belief swaying the governor of Alabama last week to sign a law that makes performing an abortion a felony. Providers now facing the possibility of 99 years in prison. And the only exception is if the pregnancy causes a serious health risk. It's the most un-American thing to me. Portland resident Ariel Bernstein has been standing up for women's rights for years. As a mother and a midwife, she understands the gift of life, but says she firmly believes access to a safe abortion is about much more than the procedure. It's about a woman's right to choose. Women are tired of this. Men are not out there explaining to legislators how their bodies work um, or justifying their choices in reproduction. My country is saying women don't matter. Your body doesn't matter. Your body's not yours. Your choices are not yours. This frustration prompting Bernstein to speak up and organize a rally for activists here in Maine, saying it's a way for people to stand in solidarity with others across the country as thousands are expected to make their concerns known during a day of action. We are in a position here in Maine where we might feel very safe with our laws right now in our state, so we need to take that comfort and use it to be the voice for others right now. In Portland, Samantha York, New Center, Maine. The rally is set to take place Tuesday evening in Portland's Congress Square. If you'd like more information about it or the National Day of Action, head to our website or mobile app.